Okay, so the conclusion paragraph is the last opportunity that you have to leave an impression on your reader and to ultimately convince them that your choice of mascot is the best one. So the first thing I need to start with is restating my thesis, so making it again clear what I believe and what I want my audience to believe. So I might say something like, um, when you examine all the options, the Coolidge Cupids really are the best choice of mascot for our school. And then I'm going to transition into another summary of my main points and reasons. So by representing our core values, the cupids are a constant reminder of respect, responsibility, and honesty. Additionally, the bow and arrow is a clear symbol of Coolidge's academic, athletic, and social strengths. And then you want to be super creative and come up with something that is a final thought to leave the reader thinking about your essay and to leave them absolutely convinced that your mascot choice is the best one. So you might want to end with the same type of thing that you um, began with, which, you know, an interesting lead. So asking the reader to imagine something, middle of the action, quote or definition. So I'm going to say something like, um, imagine cheering day in and day out for a mascot that truly represents our student body. The choice is clear. Choose the, the cupids. Running out of space here. Okay, so I'm leaving the reader with a final lasting impression. Obviously, this is just a template, so you will need to add in some transition words and things like that to make your sentences flow. But this is the basic idea for a conclusion paragraph.